I don't mind a game like retreading old areas, but it definitely needs to be paced out. And like I've brought this up in Halo One, where the last three missions are just retreads, and it's like, if if you, let's say if you had two retread missions in Halo One, but they were kind of spaced out. In a way, now you only have ten missions total in Halo One, but if you had, if you at least found a way to have like. How should I put this? Like, let's say you revisit the truth and reconciliation, right? But you have that. You have like a mission between that and the mall. You also, I know you also have assault on the control room and all that jazz, but. I wonder, is like. The game, this game mostly has you going to new areas with the occasional chapter that will bring you back to an old area, but even then you'll, you'll still be exploring a new area. Like some rooms you didn't get to go into before. Zero Sorry, I felt compulsed to do that. I'm Superman. That was a long jump. Kind of stubborn about moving. So cool to uh, be in this room <laughs> uh, in the zero grav. Ah, that's what was alright. Wee. <laughs> Listen, I don't think it's the worst thing ever, but like. It is kind of like a... I do just wonder if like it was a tech reason they couldn't do flying around in the zero grab or if it was like a time time constraint and it was just the one thing that they had to kind of, you know, they couldn't get done in time because they're having too much difficulty. That's disorienting, hey? I thought it'd be cool to come explore the whole room while we can. She's just unrecognizable at this point, hey? faster than running, so.
I don't know what's going on there. Sometimes getting really blurry. And for 2008, like I said before, that this is uh, very impressive. And it's a case where I don't think it's a, I don't really think it's the hardware. Now my 360 is old and could be like a little um, beat up. So it's, there's a chance that part of the problems is just my 360 itself, but look at that toe. Foot. Also it's cool you can hear this thing. In here talking. Um, it's like it's it, what I was saying though is it, it's not a case where I think it was that the tech was ready for it. Um, I mean, I think you could actually you could say that maybe it's that the tech wasn't ready, but I also think. I think sometimes it's that. Who made this stupid thing? I think it's just that, like, the engine sometimes itself can't properly handle it, if that makes sense. I'm not a game dev. I don't know how to explain this kind of stuff properly, but sometimes that's just what I wonder if it's just like. The tech itself is so advanced for its day that even like engines can't uh, properly handle, handle it. That might sound really dumb, I realize, but. this hive mind. We can end this nightmare at last. We don't get to go in this door. Sad face? Let's see what the map the map actually shows us something. It doesn't. Oh yeah it does. There's a save up there so Clearly we will be coming back here. There's even the pathway. She do that? Yeah. 
Sorry, Isaac. I couldn't let him go through with it. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. We even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for helping me find him, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker, a true alien artifact recovered on Earth. They dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to Aegis 7 and activated it. And you've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. They sealed the system, and no one would have been the wiser. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. The experiment was still alive. Kind was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. See you around. Or maybe not. Isaac, Nicole, I need you to help me. Help us. Now. I'm... I'm in the flight control room. Please, Isaac, hurry. Please. I love you. All right, shit's gone to shit's hit the fan. <laughs> My biggest question is like the time we saw Nicole in person, is that is that actually her? That's still like the question that needs to be answered and I've <laughs> I've been holding myself back from not just going up and trying to like look it up online, you know. Isaac? Is that really you? I never thought we'd be together again. God I'm I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what I did. I never wanted to hurt you. You need to get it back now, Isaac. You can pilot the shuttle remotely from here. <sighs> Make us whole again. Make us whole again. Considering how everything is glitching, New diamond. Uh, it makes me very suspicious that that is purely a hallucination. Isaac, what the hell are you doing? You're making a big mistake. This is not over. Escape pod away, crew shuttle USG-09. Repeat, shuttle has ejected escape pod. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. None of us can. Here it comes. I'll reprogram the shuttle so we can fly down to the colony. We're so close, Isaac. Now go! Get on the shuttle. I'll meet you there. I want to save. Can I save? There we go. Considering how uh, everything is glitchy, we're hearing all the voices, I'm very suspect.